And what, what isn't important though isn't my own story. What I am immensely hopeful of um, is some fantastic working class MPs that are in the 2017 intake. And what is, I suppose, telling is that they are happy to speak out on issues because they are of the movement. You know, they're, 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 they're activists. And so they see the inextricable link between the street protests, the resistance in the workplace, and what Parliament can deliver. And the, not one of those elements is good enough on its own. MPs will not be the panacea to all the evils and ills in our society, but the movement will be as, as, a, as a whole. So, of course, we have absolutely no option than to prepare for a Labour government. Uh, we can't have any doubt about that because we owe it to every single person who is demoralised by the work capability assessments, for example, or the incompetent rollout of universal credit riddled with inadequacies, complications. We owe it to those fighting for better pay at McDonald's. What brave people they are taking on a corporation. <laughs> And at last we've got a manifesto, and many of you will have seen this on the doors, uh, that lifts, gives hope, it offers people a vision of what an alternative could look like. The atmosphere in my constituency completely changed on the day that that came out.